What's up, everybody? This is Dr. Tech Preacher. So, look like AT&T might have leaked the official trailer for them on the internet for the Galaxy Note 20 and the Note 20 Ultra. And I'm going to give you guys my reaction uh, as we look at this and bits and pieces of it and uh, look at all the official specs and everything in between with this official leaked trailer of the Galaxy Note 20. I'm excited about it. The keto address is in, is in a few days, but look like we got an official video that was leaked out there. And of course, we know how the internet is. The internet, people take it and they saved it and they broadcast it out there and I got a hold of the clip so I am going to let y'all guys see bits and pieces of it and I'm going to give you my thoughts about this official leaked uh, video of the Galaxy Note 20 and the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra so sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey let's go What's up guys, this is Eric back with another video. So let's go on and take a look at this about minute or so of this leak Galaxy Note 20 and the Note 20 Ultra 5G video. So uh, I'm not gonna play any sound in it. I'm just gonna show you guys bits and pieces of, of the clip of it. And I'm going to kind of highlight some of the features that we already know, uh, but uh, this is supposed to be the official leak video and let's go over it. So let's check it out. Obviously, we already know how the phone looks, the design of the phone, but the colors, look at that greenish color there. Okay, so here we go, AT&T 5G, uh, it got leaked out and it is what it is, right? So it's gonna have AT&T 5G, gonna have the Snapdragon 865 Plus processor, which we already know. Uh, the design looked like we're gonna get some new pin enhancements. Uh, the, the front of the device surely looks like a Galaxy Note 10 Plus. Uh, look like we are getting the 120 hertz display here at 1440p. As you notice, it got AT&T on top. Uh, we getting some old new S Pen features. Uh, but these are features that we're gonna get in the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. So everything we see with the with the Note features is gonna get ported down to uh, the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. They do have a new, uh, Samsung is gonna change the Notes app. Also, we get 8K recording, that is a must. We know that already. Uh, you could take photos as you're recording, uh, but in 8K, so that's gonna be pretty neat. Um, look like we're getting the space zoom, 30 times space zoom on the 20, and 50 times space zoom on the Ultra. Uh, that's something new I didn't know. Look at the battery life, 4,300 milliamp battery, and uh, look like we had something more Let's see, go back for a second. Let's go back, um, 4,500 milliamp battery on uh, the Ultra. Uh, so I went back a little bit and here we go. So yes, work and play, Galaxy Note 20, Galaxy Note 20 Ultra, AT&T. Wow, hmm, man. As far as the colors, the colors was something that uh, we didn't know, right? We knew about the Mystic Bronze and uh, but we didn't know that it was gonna be a Mystic Black or Mystic White. So it looked like we're gonna get white, black, and Mystic uh, Bronze. Bronze is the color that I'm looking forward to. I think that's gonna be a fantastic color. I think a lot of people is gonna go for that color. They didn't talk about pricing, obviously. You got to go on their website, and, but we already know that the price is gonna be about 1,400 bucks for the Ultra. Now, the for me, the Ultra is the way to go. I wouldn't recommend the 20. This the regular one, and the reason why is because you get the 1080p display, you're not getting SD card support, and the, I've heard that the pin latency is gonna be really bad on it. So I don't know that I would recommend the regular one, especially at a $1,000 price point. Look like that device is gonna be about 999, 1080p display, 60 hertz, no SD card support. Uh, you're gonna have a little longer latency when it come down to the pin. So for a thousand bucks, nah, I wouldn't recommend that one. But if you're gonna go, go for the big dog, uh, go for the 6.9 inch device. Uh, but the front of the device again looks like the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. I just wanted to make this quick video and talk about this official AT&T leak uh, video that came out, leaked on the internet. A lot of people watched it. I got a hold of it and I'm just making my reaction video. I'm hyped over it. Bring it Samsung, 
bring it. This is Eric, AKA the Tech Preacher. Leave your comments down below. Let's have a discussion about the leaked video from AT&T in all its glory. See you guys on the next video. Peace.